Hey, Sweet Pea, you know the only reason you got this job is because you're a chick, and the company caved into chick pressure. Au contraire, Archimedes. The only reason I got this job is because I promised to have sex with smart guys. <sighs> Too bad for you. <laughs> I guess you and I are the quota babes. Well, I think it's long overdue. Why should we have to settle for low-paying clerical jobs just because we have undescended sexual organs? <laughs> I'm here to prove that women are just as good as men. I'm here for the dental coverage. All right, let's listen up. Before we start work this morning, management's asked me to initiate a program to create better working conditions between our male and female employees. Oh, it's called gender sensitivity training. Hey, I got the gender right here. How'd you like to train it? <laughs> now, Carl, Carl, that's what you call your unwanted sexual harassment. What kind of harassment can we do? <laughs> hey, hey, my brother's been on a waiting list for three years to work here. So how come these two skirts get jobs right off the bat, huh? Because it's the view of this company that the workforce should reflect the diversely demographic composition of society as a whole. <laughs> Don't even think about it, Dougie. <laughs> Female employees are not to be addressed in any derogatory or demeaning words. This includes skirts, chicks, broads, babes, etc., etc. Hey, I've been working here six years and nobody ever got sensitive about what they called me. That's because you are a big flaming pie hole, Carl. <laughs> you like to be addressed? Well, my name's Wanda Honeycutt, so Ms. Honeycutt would be fine, and once we're all on a first name basis, Wanda would be okay as well. And uh, how about you? Oh, I don't know. How about throbbing mattress kitten? <laughs> you know, if you allow yourself to be addressed in that manner, you're demeaning all women. Honey, shut up. You're not helping me here. Um, look, my name's Grace. I don't care what you call me. I don't want special treatment. You guys treat me with respect. I'll treat you with respect. And if at the end of the day we all wind up in the shower together, then God love us. Oh, so <laughs> Which one of you girls is Grace, Kelly? Uh, it's women, not girls. Women, women, women. Hey, I'm 35 years old. I've got three kids. I can hide a can of cat food under each breast. And Pop speaks, I look like a girl. It makes me happy. What's up, Wilfred? Uh, well, you got a call. Your son got in a fight at school. He wants you to come down there right away. Oh, man. Look, would it be all right if I took a short break? You haven't started yet. I know. I'll make it up. It's just my son's in trouble. I'm sorry. If you go, I'll have to get someone else. Oh, well, please don't. I need the job. Come on, Bill. Cut her some slack. She's a mother. <laughs> yeah. Where's your sensitivity? You let Phil off when his wife died. It's because Phil shot her. <laughs> all right, all right. Okay. But you owe me big time. Oh, 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 oh. Now, I don't mean in a physical woman-guy way. I mean... Bring us a box of donuts. We'll call it even. Thanks. You're a sweetheart. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Dougie. Yeah, Bill. I like this world a lot better when we could just pinch him on the butt. Yeah, I hear you. <laughs>